Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And today we are going to unwrap this building model. I have already deleted the duplicated objects. So let's start with our window. Select it and isolate. Then go to create and use camera based. Now go to edge mode. Select these edges. Now go to your UV editor, in the edge mode add a cut, go to UV shell and select all of them then use unfold. Now go to edge mode again and select these edges, use move and sew. Do the same for this side and this last one. Now select the shell and use unfold one more time and orient shell. Layout. Bring back your model. Now let's unwrap this door. Go to create and use automatic mapping. Go to edge mode, select these edges. Use move and sew. Same for this side and for the sides. Use layout. Select this frame and isolate. Now go to create and select this camera based. Go to edge mode. Select this middle edge. And this one. Now go to your edge mode in the UV editor. Add cut. Select the UVs and unfold. Then Orient Shell and Layout. Select this handle. All Attach to Isolate. Again go to Create and Camera Based. Edge Mode, select this edge. And this one. Now in the UV editor, go to edge mode, add cut, UVs, select all the UVs and unfold. Go to UV shell and orient shell to fix the orientation. Same for this one. Select all of them and layout. Now select all the door components. Combine them and go to UV shell, select all of them and then layout. Now let's unwrap this pipe, isolate this, go to create and camera based, edge mode, select this edge and this one and this edge in the middle.
Now go to your UV editor. In the edge mode, add cut. Go to UV, select all the UVs and unfold. Select the shell and use orient shell. Select all of them and then layout. Now let's select this box and create automatic mapping. Select all of them and move and sew. Move and sew for these components. Now select all of them and use layout. Now let's select this door and go to create, use automatic mapping. Again, select the edges and move and sew. Isolate this one and go to create then use camera based. Follow the same procedure we did for the other door. Edge mode, add a cut, go to UVs, select all of them and unfold. Then shell and orient shell. For this one go to top view, focus, go to edge mode, select all these edges then deselect these ones. Now select these edges. Now again go to edge mode in the UV editor, add cut, select the UVs and unfold. Go to edge mode and you can see that we have some unattached edges here. So select all of them and move and sew. Go to shell and unfold one more time. Then attach these ones. And one more time use unfold. And orient shell. Now select all of them and layout. Bring back your model and select all these door components, combine them, go to your UV editor and in the shell mode select all of them then use layout. Now select this one and isolate this and go to create, use camera based, select these edges. And this one. Now in the UV editor, go to edge mode, add a cut, select UVs and unfold. Now select this shell, use orient shell, 
bring it up select this one this one is top and use audience shell this is our top so go to edge mode select these edges and move and sew select the shell and unfold one more time now select all of them and and unfold one more time now select these shells and fix the orientation by using orient shell Now select this building and isolate this. Let's go to front view and go to face mode. Select all these faces. Go to create and use the planner mapping and and in the planner mapping settings choose z axis and hit apply. Select these shells, bring them out and enable the checkers. Press R to scale. Increase the scale of these UVs to make these checkers a perfect square. Now go to right view and in the face mode select all these faces. Go to create and select planner mapping again and this time choose the axis X. Enable the checkers. Press R and scale it vertically. Now select this roof. Go to planner mapping again and choose Y axis. Enable the checker. Press R to scale. Now select these shells and go to create. Use automatic mapping. Use move and sew to attach these edges. Now select all these shells and use layout.
So we have completely unwrapped our building. Now I'm just going to apply some materials to create our texture sets and export this in Substance Painter to texture. So that's it for today and if you like this video then subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions then write them in the comment section. I'll see you in the next video till then. Thank you for watching.